Department have gone on record in opposition to this legislation because the agency reorganization is essential, even by the Secretary of State's own admission, even by the Vice President's own recommendations to save $5 billion. I can't imagine that anybody would suggest that we can't merge one agency into the State Department, that we can't merge the Arms Control and Disarmament Agency. It's a modest agency of 250 people that in this day and age when we need a new world order when it comes to our own State Department related agencies, we have to reorganize. And it's important to have a unified, singular voice when it comes to delivering our foreign policy. And that was the basic intent of this agency consolidation. But we have met resistance at every step of the way by the administration. Even though at some point in time the administration or members on the 